Good morning, my dear friend. Hope you're well facing this brand new week. It's a Monday morning. We have lots to be thankful for. We are working our way through Isaiah chapter 58. And Isaiah chapter 58 begins with an exhortation, really, to turn to the Lord, to deal with sin and transgression. And then he goes on to further encourage us to deal with those internal issues, but then we must reach out and touch those around us. He then promises blessing. In verse 9 it says, Then you shall call and the Lord will answer. You shall cry and he will say, Here I am. If you take away the yoke from your midst, the pointing of the finger, the speaking wickedness, there's those dealing with sins and transgressions again. If you pour out yourself... If you pour yourself out for the hungry and satisfy the desire of the afflicted, reaching out, touching the needs of others, then shall your light rise in the darkness and your gloom be as the noonday. And the Lord will guide you continuously and satisfy your desire in scorched places and make your bones strong. And you shall be like a watered garden, like a spring of water, whose waters do not fail. This next phrase for today. And your ancient ruins shall be rebuilt. In other in other words, the Lord will restore those things which have been torn down and lost because of problems in our life. Let's go to him in prayer today and just say, Lord, we want to commit to you that you can restore the glorious things. Let's pray. Heavenly Father, we're thankful to you for your faithfulness. Lord, we know you need to do a deep work in our, our hearts. We invite that so you can bring a restoration of glorious things in our life. In Jesus' name, amen.